hey y'all hey your favorite fenty reviewer is back the iconic cookies and clean mask is in a face scrub and i am here to give you the honest tea today we will discuss first impressions on how does it feel the difference between cookies and clean face scrub and cherry dove which one do i like better and is it worth your money this video isn't sponsored but Fenty, let's collab. I love you just as much as you love me. Let's get started and don't forget to subscribe. First, I'm going to spray my face down with some water. Best on damp skin, as per the directions. And then I'm going to apply a little bit on the fingertips just to give a, a honest moment to see if it's actually the same consistency as a detox clay mask. Please hold. While that dampens, when I took the seal off, I was like, yo, that hole is big, boy. That's how y'all want us to use all the product in one go? Like, hello? But this is cute. I just want to feel it because the, the clay mask, that consistency, if you own it, you know. So this is nice and fluffy. It kind of feels grainy, but then you have to remember it's a scrub. And then like in the directions, if you don't own the charcoal mask, I like to rub. You see how that turned gray? I like to rub it in my fingertips first before applying it to my face because that honestly activates the charcoal. The hint of color is slightly pink. I don't know if you guys can tell because of my lighting, but it's a little on the pink side. Hmm. So we're good and gray. Let's get the work. Girl. 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 Girl, 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 girl. Oh. Okay. I see what we doing. I see what we doing i see what we doing okay so before i apply more for my forehead it's giving sugar scrub ish you see that charcoal bead that i missed up there y'all see that on my fingers right very fine sugar finer than cherry dub i'm going to say that for the record right now so if you felt like cherry dub is a little harsh in the sugar department this is not this feels good AF. Yes, ma'am. Oh, I forgot to zoom y'all in. See how excited I got she? See how I mashed that in with my finger? I'm going to do it again for this side. I just... If you don't rub it in advance, make sure you mash that charcoal. See why it's easier for me to just do it with the fingertip method instead? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. She even draws like her cousin clay mask, too. She does. Oh. oh. <laughs> like, I kind of want to leave it on. I know it's not a clay mask, but I'm, I kind of want to leave it on. Okay, it's a lot of... You see that white residue? That's the sugar. Or I, I keep calling it sugar because it is a, a, a scrub. But that's whatever is in that volcanic clay exfoliant. Actually, let me look that up. Please hold. I was correct. As per Sephora's highlighted ingredients, it is volcanic sand and silica. Microderm inspired physical exfoliants that help unclog pores, polish, and retexturize. Is it going to polish your skin? Yes. And I'm telling you that right now. Th this microderm, what I was calling sugar about two seconds ago, that's a that's a polish. I feel clean and I haven't even taken it off yet. Don't leave it on for this long, guys. I'm just chatting. Yes, but it is more of a lighter fluff. The clay mask is very fluffy. I love her. Her cousin, she's a lighter consistency, but she still got that fluff. Let me wipe this off so we can really chit chat. I 
did not put on any toner serums anything i want to see how does it dry meaning is it a hydrating face scrub what type of products would i need to apply afterwards do i need to rejuvenate my skin and give it extra hydration or can i just proceed with a normal routine would it be okay to put the acne treatments on these nasty pimples that i got is it okay or is it not i just want to see what's the vibe giving this wiped off much easier than cherry dub does for some reason i've washed my face at the sink with cherry dub i've washed it in the shower with cherry dub and and the the sugar just likes my skin something something about this scrub where it's like i feel like i have to do a little bit more extra wipage in order to really get that girl off she she's a thicky she's thicker she's fluffier right now my skin feels regular to hydrated i do not feel dry but i am a normal to oily girly let's see if it still remains regular to hydrating by the end of the video firstly sephora describes cherry dub as a liquid formula no why when i was trying to look for this beautiful new addition and sephora said that it was out of stock in like every location mind you y'all i'm in new york how you sold out i walked to the nearest sephora on my lunch break and boom there she was right there if sephora ever says something is out of stock always go to a low-key sephora location and it's about a 75 percent chance that they would have it trust me i don't be lying to y'all cherry dub brightens she gets the job done cherry dub also buffs away the dead skin cells smooths out the texture if you have any i only use cherry when i have hormonal acne and once it's finally healed and i'm ready to be in the brightening phase so getting rid of my dark spots getting rid of any hyperpigmentation with cherry i do make sure that i do have to use hydrating products afterwards just to make sure things are replenishing and I'm making sure that I'm rehydrating my face. And I am not using anything acne related unless I really have a dark spot and I'm like, she, she gotta go and I'll just deal with the hydration later. Cookies and Clean is giving when you want to detox, when you are interested in using a clay mask, but this kind of has more of a two-in-one because the charcoal plus the scrub wow it will still smooth your texture the both of them are comparable in fixing texture i can say that this will control your oils this is an exfoliant that charcoal did it for me i knew it was going to be good i'm i'm gonna just put that on the record right there that's why i had to hit the scurry to sephora this is comparable not in, not in the, the scrub consistency, but this is comparable to Tatcha's Deep Cleanse. How clean I feel from just that little bit. Mind y'all, I didn't even OD. Y'all saw how much I put on. We did it together. Cookies gives a baby soft finish. I feel smooth. If anything, I feel cleaner. And I feel like anything that was in me just really got sucked out. Okay. I still don't suggest leaving it as long as I did, but maybe the longer I left it on, the more it was given a little. I still don't feel dry. I know when my skin is dry, when it's like, y'all can feel my skin right now. Yeah. For the record, in my opinion, since this has charcoal in it, since this is comparable to the clay mask, but just in a face scrub form, I would not pair this with uh, a clay mask. I wouldn't pair it with a detox mask. If you're going to use this, I would just carry on with the rest of the regimen. Would I pair it with a hydrating mask? Yes. Don't put, I wouldn't use this with nobody's AHAs, BHAs, PHAs. Don't do it. The charcoal and the micros, good enough. Unless Fenty come out and say otherwise. I'm just the I'm just the YouTuber chat. With with cookies, I would use my normal products. Hyaluronic acid serum, maybe like a, a milky toner. 
I still, I still feel, I don't think I'm going to get dry for this entire video. My skin feels like I did some sort of skin care. Even if I wanted to do this as a nighttime routine and double cleanse, I would still use a gentle cleanser after this, of course. So this would be like the buffer. And then you will go in with a gentle cleanser. <sighs> This is hard this is hard i feel like i like both of them but they have different properties i think that that's a that's a politically correct answer i can't act like cherry don't brighten this get my skin back it's bright cute and it's my new friend i would say you need to choose whichever scrub based off of what you need or when in doubt just get both i can't wait to finish the rest of my skincare and see how i wake up feeling i'm in love is it worth it hell yeah I don't think y'all understand. If you do not own Cookies and Clean Clay Mask, I will link my honest review below. And then they had a the nerve to come out with mint. I'll link both reviews down below so y'all can just make y'all own decision. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and click that notification bell in order to keep up with me. Tag Fenty and let them know that I'm y'all favorite girly. And I love you guys just as much as you love me. Y'all always run my Fenty numbers up. And I appreciate that you guys really enjoy my honest reviews for them. Love y'all down and catch you next video. Bye.